Welcome back, True Seeker. Another murder by numbers in the news. This time it's the father of NBA player Richard Jefferson, longtime veteran of the league. I'm going to show you why he was killed the day he was, why he was killed in Compton, California, and what it has to do with the conclusion of last year's NBA Finals on June 8th and the start of the upcoming 73rd NBA season on October 16th. So this news broke September 20th. The killing was September 19th. Both dates are important. The date the news broke, a date with 47 numerology, the father of Richard Jefferson, dead. Killing equals 47, so does Richard. The first NBA championship was in the year 47. Very special number to Freemasonry, which controls the NBA. 47 symbolizes foundation and killing is clearly a part of the Masonic Order's foundation. They murder a lot of people by this ritualistic code. September 20, 2018 was also a date with 67 numerology. Blood sacrifice equals 67. When I made my 20th return to YouTube, the first couple videos I put out were the deaths of the UCLA basketball players right after LeBron James went to Los Angeles. And if you haven't seen those videos, go over to my Gematria Effect Sports channel and watch them. Both players killed, both killed with name Gematria of 67. One of them was killed July 6th, 6-7. 67, deadly number. Blood sacrifice, 67. 67 is the 19th prime. His father was killed on the 19th of September. Also, the news of the death came on the 20th, death 20. So, from Richard Jefferson's birthday, June 21st, 21 slash 6, like 216, like the Cleveland area code who were just in the finals, like how Richard Jefferson used to play for the Cavs. Anyway, from his birthday to the date of the news was 91 days later. From his birthday to the killing in Compton was 90 days later, or a span of 91 days. The killing was the day before. And again, 90 is one of two numbers when written out that have Gematria of 33 and the most important of our base ciphers. 90 is 33. When you write out 16, it's the other one. Those are the only two numbers. But with regards to Compton, where the killing was, Compton 33. Compton's on the 33rd parallel. This code of letters and numbers is largely Masonic. Masonry 33, Secrecy 33, Order 33, Federal 33. Don't forget the Masonic headquarters is in D.C., the federal land. Anyway, 90 days after or a span of 91 days. The 91 matters too because that's 13 weeks. 91 is the 13th triangular number. If you add 1 through 13, it equals 91. That's what a triangular number is. 91 is the 13th triangular number. Richard Jefferson was the 13th overall pick of the NBA draft. And I want you to see something about the word 13. Notice this gematria of 99 and 45. Notice that? His father was killed on Yom Kippur, which has the gematria of 99 and 45. It's the most important Jewish holy day. And if you pay attention each year when Yom Kippur falls, so does tragedy, shootings, murders, plane crashes. Every single year, it's clockwork. That's why I said to watch out for this day before it happened. And what did we get? We got a boatload of shootings and celebrity deaths and a murder in Washington, D.C. that's a mystery and, you know, everything else that's flowing through. We got it all. We got plane crash. <laughs> we got murders. We got shootings. The same thing we get every single year. So the last team that Richard Jefferson played for was the team in Colorado. Colorado's the 38th state. Here's the states in order of statehood. Colorado's number 38. Also in Gematria, Colorado equals 38. In the world of rig sports, you might remember the Denver Broncos winning the Super Bowl that I said they would in October. That Super Bowl is played on the 38th day of the year. You learn this code of letters and numbers. You see how all the sports is scripted and how people are murdered in accordance with the code. Anyway, Richard Jefferson, 38 years old. Last time he played for is Colorado. Not sure if he's coming back for another season. Death equals 38, killing 38, murder 38, RIP 38. There's the murder by numbers movie poster where the letters are changed in the numbers. Just the E to a 3 and the B to an 8. 3 and 8, murder. Murder by numbers. 
The news, it came on September 20th, the day leaving 102 days left in the year. Number stamped all over black history. The N-word equals 102. Slavery equals 102. The Civil War began on the 102nd day of the year. September 19th is the day leaving 103 days left in the year. And the death came 103 days after the last NBA Finals, 27 days before the start of the new NBA season. 103 is the 27th prime number. Ritual equals 27. We'll go over that point. Richard Jefferson, June 21st birthday, 38 years old, from Los Angeles where his father was killed. I'm just going to ignore his height. He was the 13th overall pick by the Rockets. Here's what I want you to see. His full name, Richard Allen Jefferson, Gematria of 104. From his birthday, or excuse me, excuse me, from the conclusion of the NBA Finals on June 8th to the day of this news was 104 days later. From the conclusion of the NBA Finals to the day of the killing was 103 days later, also a span of 104 days. If you count June 8th and you count the date September 20th, that's a span of 104 days. When we say from June 8th, excuse me, did I just say from June 8th to September 19th, the day his father died, that's a span of 104 days. The other way to say that is from June 8th to September 19th is 103 days later. When you do that, you're not counting the date June 8th. But notice, the news comes 104 days after. The killing comes a span of 104 days from the conclusion of the NBA Finals. Richard Jefferson's full name is Richard Allen Jefferson, which sums to 104. And that's the cipher you're supposed to use to decode a person's name. The most important of the base four ciphers. They put out this motto, prayers up. Where'd they get that from? Prayers up 104. You see? Like 10-4 message received. And understand, this code of letters and numbers is not supposed to be for the masses. It's supposed to be for the elite. This is the secret knowledge of the elite. A lot of interesting things about the name Jefferson. 44, 46, numbers that connect to killing and execution. We'll come back to that. With regards to Jefferson last playing for the Broncos, or excuse me, the Denver Nuggets, the basketball team in Denver, Denver equals 68, basketball 68, sweep 68. If you weren't following my work, I said why the Cavs were going to be swept on June 8th before the finals even started. Did that on my radio show, my blog. And if you followed me a year ago, when the Warriors came close to sweeping the Cavs, I pointed out then, I said had game four been on June 8th, you could have counted on the sweep. And the exact same thing happened the next year. Game four did fall on June 8th. Same thing we talked about a year ago earlier came true it was the fourth straight finals between the teams four game series lebron james coming short of winning his fourth championship four what's four in numbers how about the bible what's the fourth book of the bible called numbers where this code of letters and numbers comes from king james has a bible named after him you know anyway Denver 68, basketball 68, sweep 68. The sweep was on June 8th. Then we get this murder ritual corresponding. 103 days later, a span of 104 days. Prayers up. It's sick when you know it. You know what else I'm realizing? Oh my God. Richard Allen Jefferson is the um, name of the basketball player, and it's also junior, which equals 114. See how it's 114 right here? So is senior, 114. And you know what that is, right? That's LeBron James, 114, who just went to Los Angeles, who we've seen all these murder rituals in connection to. His father was killed on 9-19-2018. 9 plus 19 plus 20 plus 18 equals 66. LeBron James, 66. LeBron... 66, you know, they call LeBron a beast. Beast equals 11. When you add 1 through 11 together, it equals 66. He was the first player to go to six straight finals since 66 when Bill Russell did it. So you add on the junior and senior, and the riddle becomes all the more clear. Prayers up. 
So they said this was a drive-by shooting, right? Drive-by shooting equals 213. The NBA Finals equals 213. The shooting was in the LA area code, the 213 area code. Reminds me of Tupac Shakur. We just passed the anniversary of his death. He released All Eyes on Me February 13th, 2 slash 13. He died 213 days later due to complications from a drive-by shooting. At least so it was reported. Don't forget, two years ago, LeBron James played his 213th NBA game on June 1st, the day leaving 213 days left in the year to start the NBA Finals 2-1-3. The news story that day was that somebody had spray-painted the N-word on LeBron James' house. You know, 2-1-3. It's another number that's associated with Black History. Black History Month's 2-1-3. Black Panther, 2-1-3. There's more to that riddle. Tupac's mom was a Black Panther. Here's the other thing. Uh, Richard Jefferson. He's played 17 career NBA seasons. I'm always talking about how important this number is to the NBA. NBA equals 17. Kill equals 17. Mason equals 17. It's run by Masonry. Masonry uses this code of letters and numbers. The NBA season, one more time, it begins October 16th. It's going to be the 73rd season. It begins in 27 days. From the NBA Finals to the death was 103 days. 103 is the 27th prime. Ritual equals 27. Remember when LeBron James won the NBA Finals on the real King James's birthday? He scored 27 points in that game, and it was the 103rd game of the Cleveland Cavaliers season. Go, below, go back and look it up. The uh, actor who died that day in the news was Anton Yelchin, the young actor who had been in the Star Trek movie that was about to release. He was 27 years old. He had birth numerology of 103. Remember it like it was yesterday. Then do you remember what happened 27 days after uh, LeBron won the NBA Finals on the real King James's birthday? I do. Nate Thurman dropped dead at age 74. Nate Thurman, who had his number 42, retired with the Golden State Warriors. And the Cleveland Cavaliers, 42. 42 with both teams. Have you ever looked at a picture of Nate Thurman? Look at Nate Thurman real carefully. Nate Thurman, number 42 for the Cavs and the Warriors. He looks an awful lot like LeBron James. Steph Curry, LeBron James, both born in the same hospital in Akron, Ohio. What are the odds? You know, Del Curry, the father of... Steph Curry, who do you think is the father of LeBron James? I can't prove it, but if I could, and maybe someday we will, I'd bet a million dollars if I had it that uh, Nate Thurman's the father of LeBron James. I'd bet a million dollars on it. Similar build, great basketball players, same exact hairline. You know, he doesn't look ex identical to Nate Thurman, but a lot of features and similarities. So, September 19th, 18, it was also a date with 46 numerology. 46, Jefferson 46, Sacrifice 46. Since this came on Yom Kippur, the Day of Atonement, the important Jewish holiday, I should also mention that's 46. You're supposed to atone on Yom Kippur. Atone 19, dead on the 19th. Before the 73rd NBA season, sacrifice 73, ritual sacrifice 73. Who wants to bet that uh, Steph Curry, born on the 73rd day of the year, Pi Day, is going to have a great season? His team that set the record was 73 wins. Del Curry once played his 73rd game of that season against Michael Jordan, the year Michael Jordan set the win record at 72, because it's all a script. Yom Kippur, the most important Jewish holy day. Who runs the NBA? Who runs the NBA? You know. Pretty sure Adam Silver's from Jupiter. Want to know something interesting about Jupiter and Yom Kippur? Jupiter 99.45. Yom Kippur 99.45. Who gave us these words? Who gave us these names? Who gave us this code of letters and numbers that synced up with astrology? Again, this is all Jewish mysticism. The murder was also in Compton, Los Angeles. Compton, Los Angeles, 83, like murder, like how Murder by Numbers, the song came out in 83, like how the movie poster for Murder by Numbers changes the E to the 3 and the B to an 8. 
three and eight, eight and three. Murder, 38, 83. Again, Richard Jefferson's 38 years old. Death, 38. Killing, 38. RIP, 38. Colorado, last team he played for, the 38th state, 38. Remember how uh, the team from the 38th state won the golden anniversary of the Super Bowl on the 38th day of the year? Gold, 38. I can keep coming with the riddles. Because that's what they all are. You learn the code, you can see through all of them. This murder's for LeBron James. It's for the NBA. A lot of bodies have been stacked since uh, LeBron went to LA. A lot, and a lot more are going to stack. I've said it before, I've said it for years. Out of all the celebrities in the world, nobody dies, or nobody has more deaths connected to them than LeBron James does. Let's uh, also see how many days... LeBron's 33 right now. Don't forget that. LeBron James is 33 years old. Here, I'll show you LeBron James' birthday. James equals 33. I should mention that. James, 33. Bible, 33. Good book, 33. What is the... Computer gets worse every day. LeBron James' birthday is December 30th. He has the same birthday as Tiger Woods. 12 plus 30, 42. The only day in the calendar year that you can do that. The N-word equals 42. LeBron James, 42. Tiger Woods making his big comeback at age 42. All part of a sick joke. But LeBron, 33. Compton, 33. You know, dead on the 33rd parallel. Let's, uh, let's measure from LeBron's birthday to the date of the death. When you write out 33 as a word... It sums to 66, like LeBron, like LeBron James, like this man being dead on the date with 66 numerology. Let's measure from the 33rd birthday to the death. 919. 263 days. That's the 56th prime number. How about to the upcoming 34th birthday? <laughs> oh boy, 102 days, you know, like how the news broke on the day leaving 102 days left in the year, like how the n-word sums to 102, you see the 14 weeks and 4 days, go back and type in Yom Kippur, 144, see the 3 months and 11 days, turn that number around, 113, the National Basketball Association, 113, Big number in the Talmud. Pretty much says the uh, false Jews can exploit whoever they want. Stuff is sick, isn't it? You learn this code, you can learn to see what's really going on in the world. Oh. Something else. Keep in mind, if you count the span here, the span, it's also going to be 103 days. Coming back to how he was killed on the day, leaving 103 days left in the year. Richard Jefferson was on that team, wasn't he? Where they won in the 103rd game of the season. See? Yom Kippur is about atonement for your sins. And I've said this before. The people who run these industries and do all this sickness, they know that all the people that accept their money and play in these rigged games and make these filthy records and you know, perverted movies, they know that they're wrong. But they sit there and they feel like they have the right to judge all the people who sell out to their agenda because it's all said that they can in their Talmud. Look at them. Have you ever seen what these people do in their uh, little synagogues? They circumcise the baby, they mutilate, and then they put the blood in their mouth. Don't tell me these people aren't sick. Until next time, true seeker. Actually, I should plug it one more time. Better pick up that book, Letters and Numbers, that teaches you this code and how the whole world's scripted by it that comes through the media. News, sports, entertainment, elections, your government. You'll learn this code as well as I know it, reading this book. 773 pages, $5.
Give up the rig sports game. Invest in knowledge. Price it at $5 so everyone can afford it. It's the cost of uh, this much beer at a basketball game. You can get one sip of beer or you can get a book that can change your life. Make a wise investment. Till next time.